What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Flicking on My Big Tarot here, where I bring you the beauty, juice, and spiritual truths. I am your spirit uh, host, Miss DC. And y'all, you do not have to believe in tarot. Please do not exclude yourself from the message because this shit might actually happen. Gemini, all my information will be in the description box below. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this video. And if this is so, drop a tip in my cash app, leave a comment, and let me know. I got dinner and dick. That's what popped out. Dinner and pussy. That popped out. It might be a side note for somebody. I don't know, but let's, let's just see what the rest of this energy has to bring. Is somebody pregnant? Is it a boy? Is it a girl? I don't know why I got pregnancy. Somebody is mentally frustrated about it. A pregnancy. I get a pregnancy. I don't, if it's not, it's a, it's, it's identity that is confusion when it comes to identity or gender. So you pick whichever one. It's either somebody is confused about a gender in some type of way. Are they dealing with a man? Are they dealing with a woman? Maybe they don't know which one they're into. Or somebody is possibly um, pregnant and they're going to have a gender reveal. Somebody doesn't. I feel like somebody may want a baby. Yeah, it says take your flesh out of it. So somebody I feel like is having sex to have a baby. Somebody wants a baby. Maybe you need to get a dog instead. Uh, and I don't mean to be distasteful or disrespectful in saying that. But maybe it'll be better to have a pet than it would be to have a baby. You know, Geminis don't really do well with their kids. I don't care what kind of Gemini. Most Geminis just don't really do well with kids. I don't I don't know. Almost every Gemini that I know has an issue with not if not one all of their kids or they just Geminis don't really care for other Geminis. They usually get into it with other Geminis. But I feel like usually when it comes to kids, Geminis don't, it's something about Geminis and kids. They just don't, they just don't work. There's usually a problem. This wanted to come out. Yeah, like I feel like somebody really wants a baby. Somebody wants to give, but spirit is telling me to tell you, like, you need to take your flesh out of it or sex out of a situation. I feel like somebody might want a baby only because the sex feels good. Somebody may be gifted a baby, but it's like a married couple might find out they're having a baby. Somebody may be finding out that they're having a baby. But, but. Somebody might be sick. Or they may have issues with this. I'm telling you, Gemini. When it comes to you and kids, it's something about, something about it is off. Something about a child or a pregnancy or somebody might be receiving news that they're like, they're having a, a baby. Oh, 
Okay. Gemini. Somebody in this situation is karmic, okay? Somebody in this situation is karmic. This is probably why the baby situation is not working out, I feel like. Something about this situation is karmic. And I feel like a karmic, a, 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 a karmic couple are trying to bring a baby. If you're fucking karmic, don't bring a baby into this world. If you're negative as shit, don't bring a baby into this fucking world. In 2023, I'm cursing y'all asses out. I'm cursing y'all asses out. I'm cursing y'all asses out. There are a lot of Geminis that I love. Matter of fact, I just got off the phone with my uncle. Oh my God. My uncle and his wife. One of my favorite, my favorite, my favorite married couple. They're both Geminis. Now, I don't know if this relates to them. I really hope it doesn't relate to y'all because, and even if it did relate to them, I have enough respect to where I would say, don't do this. But I don't believe that's them. There are two different types of Geminis. They're cool. But I'm just saying, there's a karmic situation amongst a, a married couple, Gemini, you and somebody else. There is a karmic situation, and I feel like somebody is trying. Listen, twenty twenty three, don't be bringing no babies into this motherfucking world, and y'all asses is negative as fuck, and really don't even like kids. If you like the marriage and you like the sex, why don't you all do that all the time? You can do that literally all the time, and you don't have to bring a child into this situation. Somebody, so maybe Gemini, somebody is stalking you in your relationship. Somebody, somebody may want your relationship, but don't realize that it's karmic. Or when I say karmic, this is a situation that you're supposed to go through with somebody to, to learn a lesson. Somebody is supposed to go through a situation with somebody to learn a lesson But I feel like somebody is watching. Okay, so Gemini, you are in a relationship with somebody. I feel like whoever the, the, the feminine energy is, is probably okay. The feminine energy wants a baby. The masculine energy is involved with somebody else possibly and whoever else they're involved with is kind of like watching their karmic and they're watching your relationship. So if you Gemini are deal, if you're married, and I know I know a few Geminis that are married. I know a few of them. If you are a Gemini and you are married and your wife wants a baby, or the feminine energy wants a baby, the masculine energy may be dealing with somebody else on the side who is very karmic and stalking your situation. Somebody needs to be a little bit more unique when it comes to wanting a baby, maybe adoption. There are a lot of children who need love who literally don't have parents. And educate yourself on how to get this gift that you want. I feel like somebody really wants a baby, but somebody else is in the background and their energy is negative. And the thing is, if you and your partner are, are trying to conceive and then you got somebody toxic on the side, that will literally fuck up, can fuck up a situation. So I sincerely suggest, Gemini, you get rid of this karmic-ass person on the side. Give your significant other a baby if they want it. But what I'm saying is, Gemini, y'all don't need to be having no kids. I just believe that. Geminis don't need to have kids. Geminis always have issues with kids. I don't care. I know a Gemini who um is a teacher and teaches, I think, middle schoolers. And um, actually, I have two friends that are teachers, but I think one of them 
he might get along with his kids. I'm not really sure. I, um, but yeah, that's crazy. Matter of fact, I know three Geminis that are teachers. Damn. The mess. What did I say? The mess. The relationship is a mess. The marriage, whoever you're married to, this is a hot mess. The slurp. Mm. Your wife or husband is a hot mess. And this bitch over here is a slurp. It's thirsty as fuck. The slurp. Mm, 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 mm. This, but this bitch wants the supreme. That's the supreme that be on the taco. This bitch wants it all. And this bitch is jealous. Whoever the karmic is, whoever the stalker is, the slurp. I'm going to start using that shit. This joint is a slurp for real. Mm. Slurping ass. Slurping ass. Whoever you're dealing with is a slurping ass. They thirsty as shit probably. They shit smell like noodles. And a popsicle stick don't even have the motherfucking uh, 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 joke on it. Bitch, a plain ass popsicle stick. Mm -hmm. Somebody's relationship is a fucking mess. And I hate to say it, but it just is. Look, and I feel like Gemini, your side joint going to end up doing something impulsive. So I strongly suggest you watch out for this bitch. Because that motherfucker going to come in and do something because they jealous of you and your relationship. But they don't even realize your relationship is a hot fucking mess. I mean, marriages can be that. You know what I'm saying? What y'all go through within y'all relationship, that's y'all shit. That's marriage. Marriage isn't easy. We all know that. See, 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 secretly they going to do some weird shit. Secretly, they're going to come in real quick like a thief in a motherfucking night and they're going to try you secretly. Somebody is like, this is the type of motherfucker who you you and your significant other in bed. It's like 3.37 in the morning, okay? 3.37 a.m. I don't know where I got that motherfucking number from, but, but, but that one. It's like 3.37 in the morning and this bitch tries to break in the house with both of y'all in their sleep so that they can try to fuck you. Like literally have sex with you. And you like, damn, bitch, you couldn't call me in the morning when you know my partner was at work or, or you know, we could have been in, in, in the middle of something, in the middle of the motherfucking night, the bewitching hour. Listen, y'all gonna have to stop dealing with these toxic ass fucking people. And Gemini's, y'all know y'all fuck with anything. Y'all do. Y'all will fuck anybody. Like... You all will fuck anybody. I'm just saying, I know Gemini energy. And look at Donald Trump. I bet you Donald Trump be, man, Donald Trump probably be fucking on everything but Ivanka Trump. Is that her name? Ivanka? Well, the wife, whoever that bitch is. See? Because it's a one-sided situation. This bitch said, listen, you're going to give it to me or I'm going to break in your house at 3.37 in the morning and I'm going to give it to you. And I don't care if your significant other is there. Gemini, I'm just telling you, if you don't, you motherfucking better.